Hello there. Today I'm going to show you how to run a hash key with a simple command to extract a Bitcoin wallet password. We have successfully created our hash file in our previous video. If you didn't saw it, please check the video down below before continuing. So let's go to hash key and I'll show you how it's done. Uh, since we have successfully extracted our hash file, now we can download hashcat and try to hash this password from our file. To do so, you will need to go to your browser and you should type hashcat. You can see that the website has popped up over here, it's hashcat.net, but I will hit enter to click on Google and one of the first results that you will see will be hashcat. Let's go to hashcat. You can see that we can download hashcat binaries over here. Let's click download. Okay, we will download to our desktop. Our archive has successfully downloaded. Let's unzip it. Okay, close it. Extract hashcat. Okay, it's done. Now, let's go inside our hashcat folder. Over here you can see all the files. We will need to transfer us our hash file over here. Okay, it's done. Now let's go to example one and edit. Okay, here is our basic hashcat command, which is start hashcat. The type of hash is zero. You can see all the supported hashes over here. Let's go. There are plenty of different algorithms supported by the hashcat. So you should check out yours. In this case, we are going to use this one one moment. It's a Bitcoin and Litecoin wallet. Okay, let's close it. So we'll go with hash type 11000. Then we'll go with maximum power. It's W4. And our attack will be brute force attack, which is A3. You also can see the types of supported attacks. Wait a minute, where I saw them. Okay, over here we have our attacks. So we have straight, combinationary, brute force, number three, which we are going to use. Hybrid, which is word list plus mask. Hybrid mask plus word list and association. For the purpose of this video, I will show you how to do the brute force attack on our file. Okay, so let's hide it. Okay, so it's type 3. We have our example hash. Our hash is hash. Hash dot txt. We are not going to use a dictionary. Okay, so the type of attack is AAA, which means basically all the symbols. You can see over here, where was the symbols over here? There is each letter that represents the set of symbols. We are going to use A, which is a combination of those four. Okay, let's close our browser. Okay, so the command will look like this. Hashcat, exe, algo, bitcoin, use maximum power, type of attack, brute force. Our target file is our hash file from this wallet that we have created over here in our previous video. And we will try with four symbols. Okay, so let's save it. Let's double click it. Okay, so our program is running successfully. You can see that it has found an NVIDIA GPU RTX 360. You can see that our self-test has started and in few short minutes our hashing will start as well. As you can see we have started hashing, let's hit S and you can see the information about our hashing. We are hashing at 1800 hashes per second. The total amount of hashes will be this one. Rejection 0 and recovery 0. So this is basically how you run your hashcat. Well, you saw how to run a hashcat. You know how to run a brute force command now. With that being said, I hope you liked this video and it was useful to you. Please use it only for education purposes only and not to do some hacking stuff. 
This was Alex. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for still more content.